Hi everyone, this is Christine. I wanted to give you a little more instruction about adding an image to your blog post for the first assignment. I'm at a search engine here and I'm going to type in online learning and enter and in this case since I'm using Google I'm going to click on images and see what it gives me. My speed is a little slow here at home. Okay, let's say I want to pick this image um, that's with the books and the mouse top or, and the mouse uh, instrument. I am going to click, I'm going to click on it to get this menu. I'm, I'm going to do in this case save image as and I'm going to say save it to my pictures file. Um, let's call it books online and then I'm going to hit save. In fact I'm going to make sure I pick my pictures file first. I'm going to hit save. In this case now it is part of my um, my it's stored in my system online. Now I'm going to go over into the course and paste the image there. Okay, now I'm back in Course Sites and I'm in the Blog tab and I'm going to hit Create Blog Entry. I'm going to select that and I'm going to just call this Test of Image and I'm going to go down in here into the body of the blog entry. This is going to be different than what I told you in the instructions. I'm going to go to this button where it says Insert Edit Image. I am going to browse my computer. Then I'm going to go into my picture library and I'm going to scroll down to find that image that I just saved in this file. And there it is. Books Online. I'll select Open. I'm going to give it a description and a title and then I'm going to use insert and there it is in my blog entry when I have it the way I like it and that looks to be a good size to me then I'm going to select post entry in your case you'll add some text to this and then post entry do not use save entry as draft I don't know why, but that button doesn't work. It doesn't save it as a draft. So use Post Entry and go ahead and select that. And now you should see uh, as my system comes up here in, in the side panel here next to the blog it gives me a list of who's already in there or what the entries are if I look at test of image, there it is. There's my entry and then I can select comment and make comments on it. So I hope this helps and I apologize for any confusion, um, but keep, keep the comments coming. I'm interested in helping you have as much success in the course as possible. Good luck. Thanks.